I started having pain radiating down my arm and numbness, and it continued to get worse. So I started receiving some treatment, uh, physical therapy treatment from some trainers, and did that for several weeks and the pain continued to get worse. They referred me to an orthopedic doctor in the Houston area. I saw this doctor and over the course of the next few weeks, he continued uh, having me receive the therapy and gave me uh, two steroid injections. Those injections did not uh, alleviate the pain or the numbness and he ordered additional tests. I had a CT scan done and an EMG nerve test done. And when I came back in to receive the results from him, he sat me down and showed me the results and said, this is not my uh, area, but you need to have surgery. And it's not a matter of when you have it, it's how quickly you can have it. And he referred me to two doctors in the Houston area and I called and made appointments. Uh, the one doctor couldn't see me for quite some time. The second doctor, who actually came recommended to me from other people as well, I called over and talked to his staff. They said, well, we cannot see you for several weeks, but we need to see your results of your test. If you can drop those off by the office and we will have the doctor review them and get back to you. So I did that, I went and picked up copies of all the tests, took them directly to his office. They called me back and said that the doctor had reviewed the test, he couldn't see me for several more weeks because he was very busy, but that the problems that I had with my cervical area were in my C4, 5, and 6, and I was having um, so much pain, I asked them if I could get in sooner. They said, I'm sorry, he's too busy. Um, so, but they scared me to death because they talked about the prognosis. They talked about how I needed to immobilize my neck. I didn't need to be doing anything uh, activity wise and talked about if I didn't do that, I was risking par paralysis. And um, it was very, very scary. So I had a friend who had had surgery with Dr. Courtney here in the Dallas area. So I got his contact information and I called his office. They were wonderful at the office. They got me in with just a couple of days and I drove up to the Dallas area, brought all my test results and dropped them off at his office. He reviewed everything. So when I went in to meet with him, he, had all the information that he needed and went over everything. And I told him how you know, scared I was about what they were gonna do to me um, surgery-wise. I told him what the previous doctor had told me and how I just was terrified at what could happen. Dr. Courtney spent probably an hour and a half with me reviewing all of my test results, showing me everything on the CT scan, talking to me about my prognosis, alleviated so much of my stress and my worry. Um, when I left his office, I felt so much better about what I was facing. So he talked to me in the office about what the procedure was going to be like, what I needed to be doing in the meantime, uh, that his office would take care of, you know, contacting my insurance company and getting everything approved. He talked to me about exactly how the procedure would go, what kind of equipment he was going to use. He talked about how he had his own equipment, why he developed his own equipment, but I had a choice. I didn't have to use his equipment. He had access to other medical equipment that he could use for the implants, and the choice was mine. And so I took some literature from him and read up on it, and um, I called him back on my, when I went in for my next follow-up appointment and told him I was perfectly comfortable using the equipment that he had developed. So I contacted Dr. Courtney's office. They got me in within about 48 hours for an appointment. And after we talked about the surgery, made plans for that, I made a decision to go forward with him. I felt very confident in his ability to take care of the problems that I was having and, and to relieve the pain that I was in. He 
put me in the hands of his staff. His staff was amazing, getting everything arranged, taking care of the insurance, getting me set up with the hospital. Uh, the hospital that I had the surgery done at was awesome. The staff there, again, took great care of me. Dr. Courtney was right there. Um, I had surgery within two weeks of seeing him, and when I woke up after surgery, I was 99% pain-free. I was so grateful at that point. Sorry. What's that? Emotional? I, yeah, I was in such pain. Sorry. Yeah, it's okay. Talk about it. Well, the pain was so bad before the surgery, I couldn't sleep. I couldn't do anything. Um, when I woke up, I just was so happy that I didn't have that pain. And by the second day, I had no pain whatsoever. It was just, it was such an amazing relief and I was so grateful that he actually did what he said he was going to do. And so now here I am two and a half years later and I've had no issues, no problems, no pain whatsoever. I live in Costa Rica now and I am very active. I go hiking, zip lining, uh, ride my four-wheeler, and you know, I live a very active lifestyle. I put a lot of stress on my body and I've had no problems whatsoever since I had this surgery. And I'm so grateful for his skill and his expertise and his kindness through it because I was so terrified to have this surgery and he put me at ease instantly. And you know, I trust him 100%. In my opinion, he was the best doctor for me and I feel confident in his abilities and his skill to take care of me and to take care of my friends. I have referred many people to him over the last two and a half years to have treatment or uh, get his opinion on uh, how they need to proceed with their, their issues as well.